all right everyone welcome back so in this video i am going to show you how you can run php code inside your terminal or how you can use php interactive shell inside your terminal or command prompt so let's get started for this you will uh, as always you will need to have installed php inside your system for that if you just type php tech v it will show you the php version that you have installed in your system so in this case i am using php 8.1.3 so in order to pile up the php interactive shell just type php tag a and this will start php interactive shell now here we can write any php code and this will execute it so let's try the basic one which is hello world we are using H echo hello world and if i hit enter as you can see we uh, successfully printed the hello world inside the php interactive shell inside the terminal so now uh, we can create variable let's say uh, x equals to hello world and then we can print this using echo command so dollar x and as you can see we printed there now we can create function and classes so let's create a function with name greetings and which will accept it's a parameter with uh, with name and we are just printing hello to that person so hello name and we will close the parenthesis now we created a function or method now let's uh, call this method so for there just type greetings and you will have to pass the argument so let's pass to see zaman and semicolon because php has a case sensitive language so if i hit enter as you can see we uh, uh, displayed the name so it is wrong so as you can see we displayed that so you can write any php code you want and this will php interactive shell will execute that code and give you respond you can try loops and other steps as well so now let's see how we can execute a file uh, so here we are typing our writing our code and then we are executing it uh, this way so so to if you, let's say if you have a file uh, a php file where you have some code so how you can execute that inside your terminal so let's, let's do it i will stop this uh, process now let's create a php file uh, a basic php file so i'm going to use name editor let's uh, let's name this greetings.php and let's create a uh, basic structure of his basic php file php and it is going to just print hello world you can do uh, everything you want here and at the end let's add control backslash n this will add new line so let's uh, save this and exit let's uh, execute this file inside our terminal using php interactive shell so you can do this uh, using the php and then the file name so in this case it is greetings.php and now if i hit enter you can see we successfully printed the hello world and in that file we have just hello world that's why i displays this so you can write function and classes and methods and uh, everything that you can uh, you can execute on the server you can execute it right here in the uh, interactive shell or php uh, terminal so for uh, for more in uh, the this php uh, has a lot of uh, information you can view those using the main page you can view the main page of uh, php so for that just, just type main and then php it will show you the uh, the whole description that are available and the command that are available to uh, to view and take advantage of so if you type that as you can see there are a lot of information and we typed uh, php tag app or interactive shell so it, it is uh, right here in the first one so it says run php interactively so you can in interact with php directly here and there are a lot of options you can try these yourself so go ahead and check this out just type php uh, main php it will uh, it will it will show you the the main page of php where you will find a lot of information so thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one